everybody, welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, it's gonna be a date night between me and Lauren, uh, taking her out to dinner. First things first, we have to go to Dave's house. Shout out to Dave if you're watching. I don't know if you guys remember this, but I did say that I sold my rear diffuser to Thomas. Shout out Thomas if you're watching this. Dave bought a, I think it was a used diffuser from somebody and I need that box. So I'm headed to his house right now. It's about like an hour away from where I'm at, but it's fine because we actually looked up uh, an Italian restaurant that's like literally minutes from his house. So this works out, this is perfect. We're on the way right now. We're about maybe 30 minutes away. Um, and man, we're just driving like down this crazy road. Like it's like in the middle of nowhere, it looks like. Like I feel like this is what people think Arizona looks like um, every day but it's really not the case. So yeah, it looks like we're on the way to Cali right now. But yeah, anyways, um, so we're gonna head over to his house. I, I don't know if he's gonna let us see his car. I put his Instagram and stuff like that in the bio so you guys can check out his build. But he did have uh, the FD2 build before I did. So I've known of Dave for a while, but I just, I know he, we have like mutual friends, but I've never met the dude and I've never seen his car in person. So this is pretty cool. I'm excited and um, I can't wait to see it if he hopefully lets us um, see it. So. Pause, man! Do you hear what he just said? guys so we're here at dave's house shout out to dave he's got my box man these are the gps and these look so nice man how much did he charge you to paint it six that's not even that bad man damn got the moving front grill you gonna put the grill pieces on soon or yeah damn it looks good man looks real good so this is it right here huh? is it the box yeah all right cool Thank you, man. I appreciate it. No problem. This is a perfect fit. I think shipping is going to be like 200, but hopefully this will fit in the bot in the car. All right, Dave. So thank you, man. Uh, thank you for the box. Secured the box. I didn't want to show his house because I didn't really want to put him on blast or where he lives or wherever, where we're at. But anyways, we're about to go check out this restaurant, Italian restaurant. Super excited. Very hungry. Um, haven't ate since when? Like breakfast, right? Yeah. Like literally yeah, like all eight o'clock in the morning. So we're pretty hungry. We're going to go eat right now. And um, yeah, I'm excited to take you guys along. All right, so she got the chicken parm because she always gets that. <laughs> and then I got the pasta bolognese, which if you guys don't know what bolognese is, it's, well, you're about to see what it looks like, but yeah, so I like this place. The vibe is, the vibe is here, the vibe is here. Very, very old school, very, uh, very East Coast. I like that. All right, guys, so first up, we got the Capri salad. So basically, it's like a salad with mozzarella cheese, um, tomatoes, and what is that? Tabagol. Tabagol? Or prosciutto. Or prosciutto. So looks really good. About to devour this. <laughs> well, that salad didn't last long. Really good. Um, they did get some garlic bread to us, um, but yeah, that was really good too. It didn't last long either. But man, yeah, you could tell a lot by like how a restaurant, um, just by how they present the food and like the ingredients is really good as well too. So, so far, um, I'm liking it a lot. What about you? <laughs> All right, so the bolognese, that's the garlic bread, and that's the chicken parm. This looks really good. I'm about to handle this real quick. I'll be right back. <laughs> All right, guys, so we just left the restaurant. I will say this, um, I'm very picky. We're very picky of Italian food, mainly her because she's Italian, but I've grew up with Italian food and I do have Italians in my family. So I know like what to look for and it was okay. Like it wasn't great, right? Like it was, yeah, 
it was it was like it, it was a good like lunch italian spot yeah. maybe not dinner right so i would probably give it like a 7.5 out of 10 what would you yeah. i would well when i ate the chicken i said it ate okay the chicken was good but the pasta dude. So yeah, the pasta was but a little the salad, lacking. The salad was pretty good. The salad was good. Garlic bread was good. Yeah, the service was good. So yeah, I can't very, really harp on that. Very like family oriented. Very family oriented. So that was a plus. So maybe I'll just give everything in the experience maybe like an eight out of ten. Yeah. So, but anyways, um, so now we are headed to go get boba because I haven't had boba in a minute. So we're gonna go to the spot near here. It's called Bomb Boba. Um, it's really big on this west side of town. I don't really get it. Uh, where we're at because we're on the east side so So I got taro slush with boba, and then she got a Thai tea one. So it looks pretty good. It's not shake. Shake it up. So I don't know how she ended up with my drink, but <laughs> I guess uh, this Thai tea is mine. It's really good. I'm pretty sure she got a regular, not a large, but... Yeah. Alright guys, so we just left Bomb Boba right now. Um, really, really good. Nice cars. Never have any complaints about their boba. Um, however, she didn't like her drink, so I had to finish it. I liked it. I um, prefer to after. Yeah, so... <laughs> um, but yeah, we're gonna head home. I'm probably gonna end the vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed this little date night slash uh picking up a box from dave so if you guys want to see more content hit the like button also subscribe to the channel if you guys want to see more stuff about the civic and vlogs like this um and i'll see you guys in the next video peace